So today I'm briefly just going to go over what something you might start hearing more about, uh, divestiture or divestment. Uh, this is something that you may hear about in the context of potentially mergers and acquisitions. Uh, let me sh share my screen real quick. Uh, so what is a divestiture if you hear about this or a divi divestment? Uh, it's a similar term, divestment or divestiture. Uh, I consider it a reverse form of mergers and acquisitions. Uh, essentially, you're selling off or closing just part of a business or a certain asset. And you'll hear this probably more in the context of certain distressed assets. More typically, uh, a business may want to divest or remove that asset or that division. Uh, maybe it's not performing very well and it's bringing the whole business down. Uh, it's typically a direct sale or closing of a certain, maybe a certain division of the business. Common terms that you might hear is a spin-off or a split-off. Uh, these are types of divestments or divestitures typically. And here's a sample of a divestment through a spin-off. So essentially what you have here is you've got the owners of a main parent company and that company has a couple different subsidiaries that they own. It could be LLCs or corporations. And within each subsidiary, there's a different division. So they might have, you know, one type of operations here, a different type there. And let's say for this example, division one is the subsidiary that's not doing very well, or maybe it is doing really well, and somebody wants to potentially acquire it, or they don't want it to be part of the main business. Usually it's when it's not performing. And so they spin it off. So essentially the owners of the parent company still get an ownership interest in this division one subsidiary, but they will own it directly. It will no longer be par part of the parent company with division two and division three over here. So they've spun it off. So the ownership might be similar or the same, but the parent company and that other business is still completely separate. So it's spun off. Split off um, could also be potentially a sale. So here we have the same structure, a parent company with three subsidiaries for different divisions. And then basically it's either a sale or some other transaction where they basically get rid of that subsidiary is no longer owned by the parent company or the original shareholders of the parent company. It's completely separate and it's no longer part of the company. So that's just some common forms of divestments. And so you may hear more about these, uh, especially when it comes to distressed assets uh, in the future. Thanks for watching.